number 87. Number 87 wants us to put this into slope and intercept form, identify the y-intercept and the slope, and graph it. Our goal is always to isolate the y when doing slope and intercept form. So, first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to subtract 4x to both sides. So we're left with negative y equals negative 4x plus 3. We don't want to have a negative for our output, especially in slope intercept form, so we divide both sides by negative 1. We get y is equal to 4x minus 3. <clears throat> we did our goal, there's nothing in front of it, anything like that. So our y-intercept is, or our y is isolated, this is in slope intercept form. y-intercept is equal to negative 3, and our slope is equal to 4 over 1. From this point, we can do a rough sketch of what it would look like. So y-intercept, we go down 3, 1, 2, 3. And then from here, slope is equal to 4 over 1. That means we go up 4. 1, 2, 3, 4 over 1. And if we want to go reverse, you go down 4, left 1. 1, 2, 3, 4 over 1. All right, and that's for number 87.